it going guys, Sharblox here. A few days ago, Roblox released some Christmas items. I was planning on making a video on these, but I wanted to wait a couple of days to see if anything was going to happen with them. And so far, it's been about two to three days and literally nothing has happened. It's really strange to me that Roblox would actually release Christmas themed items in late January. Also, the fact that Roblox did nothing with them is kind of weird. Anyway, in this video, we're going to be taking a look at these items. We're gonna see if we can figure out what they're going to be used for. So let's go over to the Roblox website and let's check them out. So here are all of the items. Now, I just wanna show you guys how old they are before I review each one. As you can see, they're around two to three days old. So they're pretty new. And it's kind of strange that Roblox would release something Christmas themed in late January. I mean, it's almost February already and Roblox decided to bring out these brand new Christmas items, which is very strange. So the first one is the festive cloak. And I just realized something. These were actually UGC items, which were uploaded using the official Roblox account. The description of this thing says the perfect cloak for festive rogues. So you guys get the idea. It's clearly a Christmas item. And that's what I'm trying to say. Why would Roblox release a Christmas item in Jan and then completely abandon it? That is really weird to me. The item itself, it looks pretty good. Like it's well made, everything like that. It's just kind of strange that it's a Christmas item at this time of year. This one right here is called the Silver Holiday Trophy made by 0929 LEGO. And the thing is, this hat looks like a classic Roblox accessory. And the reason why I say that is because those old Roblox trophies used to sit on people's heads just like this. And this one does the exact same thing. We've got the Icicle Horn made by Inkwaves. And this one is literally just like a unicorn type thing. It goes on your avatar's head. We have got the Spanner Shades made by Domiscuous. I think that's how you pronounce that name not too sure but these are clearly like spanners which have been bent and then they've turned icy and they've turned into glasses yeah kind of unique i guess the description on the holiday monitor head is a little bit different it just said made by ashcraft so maybe this person doesn't have twitter or i don't know but clearly this is like a tv that goes in the avatar's head like those classic roblox kind of like monitor tv style things and yeah this one's okay it looks pretty cool and um, like i said another christmas item in january very strange and then we have Ice Gem Necklace made by Wispy Tipsy. So this one is a neck accessory and it looks like that. It looks okay, just a basic neck accessory item. Now, the thing about these items is there's not really any information to suggest why they were uploaded by Roblox. I mean, why weren't they uploaded in December by the people with UGC access? I did see some YouTubers say that they were going to be part of a Roblox Christmas event. And what the hell? That's just stupid. Why would there be a Roblox Christmas event in January? I think they were kind of just looking for an excuse to make a video. Um, but yeah, these items, they are abandoned. They're very strange. They're probably not going to go on sale because why would a Christmas themed item go on sale at this time of year? year like I said previously so I don't know I guess they're just abandoned so if you liked any of them maybe you've got to wait until next year so there we have it guys that is pretty much it for this video let me know your opinion in the comment section I'm really curious to see what you think about these I don't know if it was some kind of competition where these UGC creators got to send them to Roblox something like that but these items they pretty much just seem abandoned if you guys enjoyed this video as always make sure to leave a like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one